Give you a little information on this tree here. This is the uh, Arbutus mensesii, our native Arbutus tree. And these grow in very rocky, fast draining soil or sandy soil. And um, these are indigenous to our island. So the bark on these ones peels off like a eucalyptus. It's a broadleaf evergreen, native to this area, of the Pacific coast of Canada. So in the spring they bloom. And a lot of people think these are related to eucalyptus trees because of the peeling bark. But actually, in fact, they are in the heather family. So see these flowers, these little upside down urn shaped flowers? Well, go look at a heather and you'll see they have the same type of flowers on them. Then they're followed by berries. Well, I'm actually doing a video of just explaining about this tree to people that they're in the heather family. This is this tree, Madrona arbutus mensesii, is not related to eucalyptus. And a lot of people think because the bark peels on them like a eucalyptus tree. They're not, they're not, yeah, a lot of people do. They're, they're actually in the heather family. So if you look at the flowers on these, they're upside down urn shaped like a heath. And these are indeed, and in that's the same family. It's the same family as heather. No, that's my clone. <laughs> <laughs> Good one. Good anyway, so that's what I'm doing. I'm kind of telling people that these are actually in the heather family. Aren't they beautiful? So the bees like them and the, um, the hummingbirds actually really like these flowers too. The hummingbirds too. like them too, but you know what? <coughs> Who's me like I, they're my favorite trees. They're amazing trees and they're one of the hardest trees to transplant. They need exacting requirements. They hate root disturbance. They don't like extremes of cold either. They will not grow anywhere else in Canada. Yeah. This is this is, this is it. This is it. Because I get a lot of people when they see my videos or pictures, can we grow this in Ontario? I says no. No, I don't think not so. a hope in hell. Sorry folks. Yeah, you have bad. to come here to the yeah. southern Gulf Islands. Or just no, stay where you are. Yeah, you, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know you didn't mean that. <laughs> yes, I do. I'm from Ontario. Oh, are you from Ontario? Are you missing Ontario? No. You don't miss the climate? I heard the climate's very harsh. Well, you know what? The winters it's very are weird. It, the, the climate is just weird because now when I was a kid, yeah. you could skate those ice storms. When yeah. I was a kid, you could skate on top of the snow. They had an ice storm ice last this, week yeah. or two weeks ago. Yeah, but they haven't had those in a while, but they used to be like... Well, you know what I say? We're fortunate yeah. here in the banana belt of Canada. We don't get the extremes, yeah. right? You know, but you know, when we do get a little snow, people like to bitch about it. Well, it's a temperate rainforest. It is a temperate yeah, rainforest. Get that. They're going, it's raining. No. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You know, and the thing is our rain comes in the winter time. Most of the rain is in the winter. Our summers are bone dry. I know. It's bone dry. It's really dry. Really? Actually. It's scary dry. It's I mean, scary dry. you see this park? It looks like the Sahara Desert in the, well, in the summertime. So does my lawn. Everything, yeah. Because I don't water it, you know, it doesn't, it doesn't need it. No. Really. 